teased. What is good everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Before we get into the video today, I do want to give a huge shout out to SM underscore battle underscore stories on Instagram for making this wonderful YouTube intro for My Damn Toys. Guys, thank you so much for the awesome feedback on the intro. He appreciates it so much. If you do, if you guys do enjoy the new intro, please go give him a follow on Instagram at the following on the screen there. You can go give him a follow. He also has a YouTube channel, and I will provide both links in the description for you guys to go follow him. He's an absolute beast, and I wanted to give him a shout out, guys. Go check out his Instagram and YouTube pages. But last night on Monday Night Raw, guys, we saw a very interesting Monday Night Raw. I mean, there were some terrible segments, as always. That's just how Monday Night Raw is. There's literal, literal, literal trash just flashing on our screen, and then little bits of dusty good stuff on top of it. But anyways, my boy Dolph Ziggler and Drew McIntyre had a Raw Tag Team Championship match with the B Team. Yes, the B Team were set to face off with the Revival for the 865th time in the span of a month. With the Revival, they were supposed to have a Raw Tag Team Championship match. Well, the B Team come out to the ring, and you know, they're waiting around, they're waiting around, and then BAM! Ziggler's music hits, and then Drew McIntyre comes out, and apparently uh, the Revival didn't make it. They did not show up for the Raw Tag Team Championship match, and um, the Dolph Ziggler and Drew McIntyre essentially fought the B-Team for the Raw Tag Titles, and when it was all said and done, very quick matchup, maybe seven minutes or less, and we have new Raw Tag Team Champions in Drew McIntyre and Dolph Ziggler. So there's Drew McIntyre. And then we have uh, Dolph Ziggler right here. And both men capturing the Raw Tag Team Championships for the first time, unless you count the World Tag Titles back in, what, 2006 or 5, when uh, the Spirit Squad and Dolph Ziggler, he was Nikki at that time, won the World Tag Team Championships under the Freebird rule. But uh, besides that point... I, this just leads me to think, I mean, now you have every single championship on Monday Night Raw all wrapped up into one feud. The Shield versus Drew McIntyre, Dolph Ziggler, and Braun Strowman. It's literal, I don't know what the crap they're doing right here. I think that it is a fact that these guys are going to be transitional champions. Dolph Ziggler and Drew McIntyre are not going to hold these Raw Tag Titles very long. I don't think they're going to have a good run at all. I think they're literally setting them up to have the Raw Tag Titles just so they can drop it to the Shield. And I think the Shield is literally going to hold every single championship that you see on Monday Night Raw. I just think that's where they're going with it. You know, we have Braun Strowman and Roman Reigns going head-to-head -head right now. Braun Strowman cashed in his Money in the Bank contract. On Roman Reigns at Hell in a Cell, those two guys will meet in a Hell in a Cell matchup for the Universal Championship. And uh, since uh, the Shield came out to, you know, foil Braun's initial cash-in, we've had a feud where they have forced Braun Strowman to turn heel, and they're trying to get this baby face push of Roman Reigns with the Shield. And um, I don't know, this is just insanity to me. I, I really don't know what's going on over there. They're literally having six guys feud, and every single championship is going to be involved in the feud. I think that for a fact, it's going to be a Raw Tag Team Championship match at Hell in a Cell. It is going to be a Raw Tag Team Championship at Hell in a Cell between The Shield and Drew's, Drew McIntyre and Dolph Ziggler. So essentially what we're going to have at the end of the night is that uh, not only is Seth Rollins and Dean Ambrose going to defeat Drew McIntyre and Dolph Ziggler, they're going to win the Raw Tag Team Championships at Hell in a Cell. I think that Dolph Ziggler and Drew McIntyre are going to literally hold the championships for five seconds just so they can keep them warm for Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins. I think this is what's going to end up happening at the end of Hell in a Cell. We're going to end up having Dean Ambrose... Seth Rollins and Roman Reigns all holding every piece of gold on Monday Night Raw. While it will be a cool sight to see, as you see here with all the members holding the gold, it will be a cool sight to see. Not going to lie, they're going to be in the middle of the ring and it's going to be flames, guys. It's going to be one cool thing to see with all these guys holding championship belts. But it's literally all for the sake of getting Roman Reigns that baby face uh, reaction from the crowd. So that's what I think is going to go down, guys. I mean, I think it's pretty much inevitable. Why would you drop? Like, the B team and Revival have been going head to head. Drew McIntyre and Dolph Ziggler haven't been anywhere near the Raw Tag Titles until uh, Monday night. And bam! Raw Tag Team Champions immediately just so they can feed them over to the Shield. And I think that's what's going to happen. While it will be a cool sight to see, and it makes for a great little picture right here, I just, I don't know. I, it, I don't know. We'll just have to see. 
It looks like we're going to go on a dominant shield run for the end of 2018. And I think at the end of WrestleMania 35, we're probably going to see a triple threat match for the Universal title is what I would think would happen. But uh, I guess we'll see. But that pretty much does it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Do you think that the Shield will hold every piece of gold on Monday Night Raw? Let me know down in the comments section below. Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE figure videos. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at MyDamnToys. Also, SM underscore Battle underscore Stories. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.